Orange County Plaza, aka the Garden Grove Mall, Garden Promenade, and now the Promenade at Garden Grove, was a shopping mall that opened in 1956. If you've clicked onto this video, then you know what today is. It's Monday, 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 Mall Madness. Every Monday I'll be releasing a new video on a defunct or maybe not so defunct mall and its history. Make sure you stick around at the very end of the videos. I'd like to see if you, the viewer, are paying attention. So if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and smash that notification bell so you get notified of my latest mall video, defunct store, or my throwback Thursday videos. Leave a suggestion or a comment for a future video. Thanks. The Orange County Plaza opened in 1956 and was considered the first major shopping center in Orange County, California. The new mall was located on Chapman Avenue between Brookhurst and Gilbert Streets. Before it became a shopping center, the land went through many uses including agriculture and a pipe works. There was even a never built residential development to be called Berryfield planned for the land. Don Shandling and Harry Rinker owned the land and they drew up plans to open a shopping center. The original plans for the center were somewhat grandiose. A pedestrian bridge was to be built across Chapman to connect to the shopping area to be built on the south side of the street. The original anchors were to be a two-story retailer, J.C. Penney and J.J. Newberry, complemented by a farmer's market. The center was announced in 1956 and was to cost $10 million. In 1956 and 1958, the project announced that Penney's, Newberry's, and Grant's would locate in the plaza. The first branch of Rankin's department store of Santa Ana was rumored to be opening there, but that never materialized. Setbacks arose. The J.C. Penney was built as a one-story store, although it did have a huge basement that could have been used as a second story. The bridge was never built, and the Newberry store, located on the south side of Chapman, was a one-story structure with a mezzanine. The real blow to Shandling's plans came when he sought to retrofit the center to become an all-weather operation. A couple years after it was built, he tried to get the center enclosed. The tenants wouldn't go along with it because it would have meant higher rents to pay for the air conditioning and remodeling. That's not the way to do it. You don't always sign everybody to leases and then afterwards try to get them to agree to something like that. The center opened in stages, first in 1956 with 20 stores and 60,000 square feet of gross leasable space on 10 acres. Stores included Thrifty Mart Supermarket and Economart Drugstore. The second phase opened in 1959, which added 40 stores and 275,000 leasable area on an additional 35 acres. This phase added anchor stores J.C. Penney, Grant's, Safeway, Thrifty Drugs, and Hartfield's department store. The Orange County Plaza prospered for nearly two decades. The mall's fortunes began a downturn in 1974 with the opening of the Westminster Mall. Retailers and customers began to flee to Tony or Diggs. During that time, a new owner of the property floated plans to modernize the center and close it with two anchors, Montgomery Ward at one end and the Broadway at the other in the late 1970s. However, the Montgomery Ward chain was purchased by Mobile Oil, which canceled all the expansion plans, basically killing the dream. By 1979, the center was known as the Garden Grove Mall. There was a $5 million renovation of the mall that same year with new anchors National Lumber and a new branch of Weinman's Department Store that opened in the east end of the mall in the fall of that year. Weinman's operated until the acquisition of the chain by Boston Stores in 1984. 
when some of the branches were converted to Boston stores. Additional stores that were added were McDonald's, Straw Hat Pizza, Citizen Savings and Loan, Bank of America, and C's Candy. From the 80s on, the mall would change names and lose anchor stores. The Garden Grove Mall would become the Garden Promenade. Today, it is known as the Promenade at Garden Grove. The site continues to function as a shopping center called the Promenade at Garden Grove. With 353,000 square feet of leasable area, it is considered a community shopping center, aka a large neighborhood center. It's no longer a mall. Anchors are Garden Grove's second Walmart, opened in 2014, formerly a Costco which had opened in 1987 and relocated in 1994. A 16 screen Regal Cinemas, Marshalls, Ross Dress for Less, 24 Hour Fitness, Aldi, PetSmart, and Dollar Tree. Congratulations, you made it this far into the video. When I find you, pop quiz, hot shot. So let's see how close you were paying attention to my video. So, how many anchor stores closed in this mall? So if your answer was six, give yourself a hand. You were paying attention. So what are some of your favorite memories of this place? Leave a comment or a suggestion for a future video below. Be sure to hit that like button. Thanks for watching.